boy underscore 392 that's my youtube channel make sure you like share comment subscribe man forget about that look i'm driving the scat pack 24 inch roaches roaches get your coochies let's get it what up 392 gang this your boy va boy and i'm back with another video guys i've been gone for a minute man been working i was sick a little bit got myself back together i hope everybody had a great new year wonderful christmas and happy new year and all that good stuff. But today's video is I got some inside accessories that I got uh, for the car, for Jackie, man. I'm about to install, need a rag. I don't think I need that rag. I get a smaller one. Got a little smaller rag. Uh, got some window cleaner that's ammonia free streak free. I'm about to install these little accessories, man. I think y'all gonna like them. I washed the car down yesterday. Actually, I did a full wash and detail on the car yesterday. Let me turn it around so y'all can see it. But you see how clean and sparkling she is right now. I'm off today, but I got to go into the office. I got to finish some stuff up. See, I'm trying to do this before I got to go in. See this? Now I'm going to have to wipe the car all down all over again, man. It's got those, uh, those water spots on there, man. But anyway, the trunk. Let me open this up. It's about to get done. I got to drop it off to my boy David, man um next week so this is the new box that i had custom built no it's not a scar box i had this custom built by uh bj um sound source making georgia he uh he built the box strictly for this sub that's a 12 inch scar sub audio um he even put the stickers on so i mean it's good man uh the trunk is about to be completely gutted out redone um new floor New panels on the side. Amp's going to be on the side with lights. It's off. So it's about to go down, man. I'm trying to get this thing ready for show ready, man, for the spring. Because I am going to travel this year. I decided to uh, make drive to Texas for the big YouTuber event. Um, I know I got to go down to Florida um, and chill out with my boy Garage Driven. Uh, I'm trying to get that set up as well. Probably maybe April or so. April, May. I'm trying to get that set up. Uh, but again, the trunk is, I got to drop it off to my boy David, man, so he can get the trunk done. I also got the um, upper uh, control arm uh, along with, well, actually, it's the camera kit. If anybody knows cars or knows, when you lower your vehicle, <clears throat> like I did mine, um, I don't have the coilovers, which that's what I should have got because I could have adjusted it up and down. But that's another story. Um, but anyway, I haven't had any issues with my lowering springs with the H and R's. It's settling really good. So um, if anybody knows anything about cars, that you have to, um, you gotta get the camera kit. So it's the upper control arm, and it's a little bar, poly metal bar about that big. It goes in the back, so they can get the alignment right. My boy Chase is gonna put that on probably within the next couple days next week then i'm gonna re-get an alignment and then i should be good to go um but anyway man let's step inside and show you what i got going on actually i got the box right there so let me go on this side all right so here i go all right so this is what we got guys We've got some things um i know you guys are gonna like let me put those up there um let me move that out of the way because I'm definitely going to have to wipe all of that down. All right, so guys, I got carbon fiber, little piece to go right here. Y'all see it? It goes right here. So I'm putting that on. Um, let me put that back in the box. I'll probably end up starting with that first. The other pieces are a little big. So let me set that right there. I kind of found one of these online. The whole thing comes out and it's carbon fiber, but I'm still trying to debate if, you know, if that's the route that I want to go or just get it dipped, uh, hydro dip carbon fiber. Uh, I got this is carbon fiber right here. Um, this goes 
right here. Um, let me see. So I'm gonna start a little bit at a time, which way I wanna do, which way I wanna go. Uh, I also got this. This, uh, as y'all can see, this goes over top of here like so. At least I think anyway. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, it goes over top. So somehow I gotta try to figure out how to take this off to fit this, or I could probably swing it through like this and then swing it around and put it on. I'll figure that out in a minute. And then I also got this cowl piece. This right here goes on right here, like so. So this goes on just like that. See that? See how clean that is? I can open it, close it still, carbon fiber. Uh, I gotta wipe everything down just to make sure that everything is gonna stick right. I'm gonna try to post this video, edit it before I go to, before I go into the office. Um, or if not, today is Monday. Y'all might see it on Tuesday. So I'm gonna start posting back with my channel, man. Just watching CJ on 32s. Um, he said even though he don't feel like, oh wow, they sent it to me scratch, guys. Look at that. See that? They sent it to me damaged. Hmm, that's weird. See, it's right here. I know y'all see that. But I'm going to try to um, start doing videos, even like he was saying, even though sometimes he don't feel like getting up, doing things, he get it to do it anyway. He got to keep grinding. And like he said, the only way the 392 gang is going is, is up, guys. See how beautiful that is up there in the sky? That's no limits right there. You can go as far as you want to go. So, uh, big shout out to CJL 32s. Big shout out to my boy Stunner Reese. Big shout out to my boy Garage Driven. Big shout out to the whole Free Smoke channel. Um, big shout outs, man. Um, YouTube on a budget. Uh, Dreway. Big shout out to you guys, man. You know, you guys inspired me to get my YouTube channel, especially Garage Driven and Fat Cat. Um, I think I told y'all that story. I was watching them, came across them on YouTube. And then up on the win, man, I was when traded my car in, man. I had a brand new uh, 2019 loaded A6 Audi. I traded it in for this, man, and I don't regret it at all. So um, big shout out to those guys. Oh, yeah, big shout out to Mod the Fame as well. That's another big YouTuber that I look up to, man. Hopefully, you know, y'all watch these videos. Watch at least this video. I'm giving y'all a shout out, man. I appreciate you guys with the motivation. And just keeping us informed on what's going on with y'all bills, what's going on with the car, so forth and so on. So enough of all the talking, man. Let's go ahead and get started installing these uh, these accessories on the inside. I'm going to try to set this down to a point where y'all can actually kind of see what I'm doing. Um, I think that'll work. At least I think. Anyway, uh, let me see if I can get this in here. Anyway, probably not. All right, so I got that set up. So let's go ahead and get that cleaned off. Get that clean. Um, go ahead and clean this knob off so it can stick because you got, look like double-sided tape. So you just gotta just clean this off real good. So when you put it on there, it automatically sticks. Same thing for this. Oops, see, told y'all. So I'm gonna have to try to work with my hand here just so I can show y'all. Y'all got to get all of that stuff clean because it's going to tape and cling to everything. So y'all got to make sure that y'all get all of that so it can stick. Let me hit screw it again right real quick. All right. So let's get this going right here. Get that clean so we could get some, some clean surface right here. Get that all done up and stuff. All right, guys. There we go. I got that part clean. So let me go ahead and clean this too. If that's got to go back over top of that. Clean that real good. So let me take this back off. Set it over on the side. Uh, let me try to get this out real quick. 
It's got this double-sided tape on here, man, that I really don't like. Um, let me try to see if I could set this up in a way where y'all can see what I'm doing. Because this thing is it's this tripod, man, that I got. It's giving me a hard time. Okay, there we go. All right, so uh, I'm taking this off. See the double-sided tape right here? see all right so got that that's the double sided tape you got to take off so you can place it right on top real good so let me see if i could dang i hate when they do this because the tape be so on there guys to where when you're trying to pull it off it just it pulls the glue it pulls the glue off this with it as well and it's kind of misplaced it out a little bit but your boy gonna try to see see that's what i'm talking about see that see how it's coming up all right so let me place that back down i already cleaned the gear shifter off so we just gotta just place down place down at least I think I think that's it this stuff man it's just crazy that you gotta try to push it do cause the glue Honda is weak, I think, personally. Um, so you can't really get, there we go, get your, there we go. Hopefully that sticks. I cleaned it thoroughly, as y'all saw. It just takes a little time to get used to um, that you got to kind of get it clean i clean the surface real good let me clean right here as well so i could kind of get all of that stuff clean so that could stick just dressing up the inside of the car i think i'm done with the outside oops i had that perfect up until my hand hit it sorry guys um so i'm trying to get it clean to where It'll stick so it don't come up. This little pieces, I'm doing the to um, dress up the inside of the car just a tad bit, guys. Uh, so I'm doing this real quick. Then I got to get ready for work. So I don't know, guys. This piece right here is kind of big. So I don't know if it's going to stick but it's got the adhesive on it right here. So hopefully this bad boy is stick. Well, this is not too bad because the way that the white film is on is to a point to where you can grab it and just pull it off. Unlike the little shifter piece and the tape is not coming off. It's actually sticking guys. It's, it's actually coming off easy. So y'all bear with me and I'll get this on here in just a second i'm thinking about getting the interior done and the headliner done doing suede with this uh twinkle i mean um with the rose voice lights uh i'm still thinking about that so i'm not sure yet i'm still out on that um so all right guys so let's see if this is gonna work right oh yeah it did it went right over top of it guys it went right over top. Man, that looked good. That fit too. It did. Perfect. Dang, that was perfect. That was that was the easiest part. Wow, I'm surprised that even went on easy, guys. 
Man, that look good. Don't you think? I ain't gonna move it. I'll show y'all when I get done. And this is, I think, th this is the last piece I gotta do. No, the this is the, the set. So I did one, two, three, and the piece over top of the cup holder. So um, I'm about to get that done for you guys real quick. Let's see, let me put all this stuff in here. So all that stuff is done and out of the way real quick. So let me put my remote to my back right there. Uh, oh yeah, so let, let me go ahead and do this one real quick because I know um, this is the piece that goes right here. So if I can figure out how to open this thing. All right, here we go. All right, guys. How's the weather where y'all at? Drop down in the comment section, man, and let me know how's the weather where you guys at, man. And right now, yesterday, I actually detailed the car as I showed y'all earlier. Uh, it was kind of, it wasn't cold because the sun was out, but I got it done anyway because my car really needed a, a full wash, full detail wash and wax as well. Um, and also, hopefully, that we'll get some warm weather soon. So I, I'm going to try to do these car shows and give y'all some some content on my channel. Um, this is different from what I usually do. Like, uh, if I do post, I may post me going to a car meet in which they had one last night, but I wasn't able to make it. Uh, but my group, SMD, scat me down. Go follow them on Instagram. Um, so they went. And they had a good time. They said it was cold out there, but I couldn't make it. So I had other engagements that I had to go to. So, but they went out there, man. They represented everybody who went. So big shout outs to y'all, uh, to my group, SMD. Scat me down, car club. We did something, what was it, last Sunday, a Sunday for last with Young Jock at Exclusive Rims. It was a customer appreciation day. But over there, for some reason, in College Park, uh, the sheriff's office and the police department really don't care for Young Jock that much. Don't know why. He's a cool dude, man. Um, down to earth, brother. Um, they shut up. They shut him down for no reason. There was. Um, we had full. Oh, see, dang. Y'all heard that? It snapped right into place, guys. So that worked out kind of. That worked out really good, actually. That worked out really good. Um, but yeah, they shut him down for no apparent reason. Um, he had a permit. Now in Georgia, it's different from Virginia because in Virginia, you really don't have to have a permit to hold like a car meet um, or any type of car show. Uh, it's just, you just only have to have a permit like if you're gonna rent out like a convention center or something like that, but you still gotta pay a convention center as well. Um, so got that but again they shut him down and won't nobody doing anything like we had um food so we had all of that stuff um uh, out there um for the customer appreciation day but again they still shut us down out there with young jock in college park at exclusive rims tires Y'all gotta go check it out, man. It's a nice place, man. Um, but anyway, they shut them down for no apparent reason. Like I said, the sheriff's department and the police department over there, for some reason, don't like Young Jock, and I don't know why. He's always doing stuff for his community, where he's from, which is over in that area, College Park. Um, he had the permit, but they still shut him down. Um, they tried to say it was a car meet, and it was not a car meet. It was a customer appreciation. And people just just came out, you know what I'm saying, just to support him, you know what I'm saying? And I just don't understand that. I guess when you're a public figure like that, there's a lot of hate and jealousy out here. Um, and actually, it's crazy. The, the sheriff's office was directly across the street from the rim shop, directly across the street. And the sergeant, he was he, he showed up first. And then there was another lady uh, cop that showed up, sheriff. Um, and then the cat, uh, then the uh, the big guy came out, who was in charge. 
and they still told him that he had to shut down or force the fine. Um, which I think everybody was kind of bummed out about that, but what are you gonna do? But just obey, right? Uh, young Jock, man, he took it good. Everybody thought he was gonna be pissed off, but he took it good. He stood there and, and talked to the lieutenant for a while, but they still weren't trying to hear it. So he was just, he just told us, man, that we had to roll. But other than that, man, Young Jock, like I say, he a good dude, man. Um, so I'm putting this over top of this, guys, so it can actually stick. Sorry and press it down all right so i think i got it so let's see yeah close got the carbon fiber right here got the carbon fiber right here got the carbon fiber. now they have the piece to where you can lay the carbon fiber right here carbon fiber right here carbon fiber all right here i know i want to get the door uh i want to get the trim to go here they got the carbon fiber pieces to go right here. They got the carbon pe fiber piece to go right here as well. So I don't want to do too much. They even got the piece to go right here too. So I think I'll just stick to just your norm. It's probably what I would stick to uh, for the carbon fiber trim. I just don't want to do too much carbon fiber. But actually, it wouldn't look that bad anyway. Because the more and more in your sports cars, they got a lot of carbon fiber everywhere too. But I know this ain't that car because it's a supercar. This one ain't. Um, but anyway, guys, I just wanted to show y'all this. Um, make sure y'all like, share, comment, subscribe to this video. Um, and make sure you click that notification bell so y'all can get notifications of the 392 Gang Man um, when I post videos. Um, I'm going to come back with another video actually soon. Um, so after the trunk is completely done, I'm going to come back and do a review on that. So, But I'll holler at y'all. Oh, yeah. And also, I got my windows retin it by the way figure it out let y'all know let y'all see let me throw this stuff in the trash and then i'll show y'all i'm gonna wipe down the car again because it's got stuff all over it so um too bad that i'm not gonna be able to put my stuff in the trunk for my cleaning but my boy david said that he's gonna build me a floor to where it actually can come up it pulls up like currently and i just put my cleaning supplies down there so uh but yeah but that's why i met with that man um make sure y'all like share comment subscribe to this video and to be a part of the 392 gang um got the accessories all that stuff done but other than that man um you know man i'm happy man it looks good it dresses it up just a little bit so but again um I was thinking about getting a wrap done, but I don't know if I want to go that route for the wrap because somebody backed into my car right here. I got to get that fixed. Uh, I took the fins off of the side. Um, but yeah, but I mean, she looks good, man. See that? No, no, she looks good. Y'all see how the tent, see how dark it is? Like you can't see in it now at all. I got the windows retinted. Jackie looks good. Um, I'm about to drain this catch can because I know I haven't drained it in a minute. Um, just give y'all this like a little brief tutorial right here. See this? She looking good, y'all. She looking good. I was thinking about ordering some more rims, but I think I'm going to stay with this look. I think it looks a little bit better, more low key. Um, going with the big wheels, I don't think I want to do that. So um, I'll just keep to this right here. Um, this is because it plays down a little bit. Um, you no, know, it just plays down a little bit. So, you know, I think I'm, oh yeah. And also I got this piece of uh, this piece of plexiglass right here. It's frosted on one side. Um, David is gonna, see how thick it is? David is gonna use this as well in the trunk somewhere. I don't know where he gonna use it, but he's gonna use it and it's gonna have lights and all that stuff. So he also got the glass etching machine where he can etch whatever I want in that. But I just don't know where to put it. But we'll figure it out once I drop the car off um, so I can get that done. It's probably going to take him probably like a week or two to finish. But I'm going to go by there once I drop the car. I'm just going to go by there um, just to show y'all kind of what he's doing. Um, just updates until he's done. And then y'all won't see the finished uh, product until the car is actually finished and it's ready for me to go pick up from David. So 
big shout outs to him um and just big shout out to everybody man 2020 was a bad year i think for all of us uh as far as you know with this pandemic going on like with my job you, you know you really can't go anywhere if you do they got states to where you can't go because if you do go then they're on the do not travel list so if i go then i got a quarantine for like 10 days and then i gotta come back and then i gotta produce a COVID test so just hoping the vaccines and everything roll out um you know let's just stay positive through this dark times you know uh just stay prayed up and just stay blessed man and just keep an open mind positive mindset uh just to kind of play off of everything of what's going on so you know i'm about to sign out this your boy va boy about to sign out make sure you like share comment subscribe to this video click that notification bell so you can be a part of the 392 gang again i want to give a big shout out to my boy garage driven um cj on 32s uh drayway youtube on the budget mod to fame audio cat oh yeah and my boy rail to rail man he getting his um he finally got the rims on his wife uh ta which i'm glad to see that um you know he about to do some big things especially to the old school so make sure y'all stay tuned for that you know um it's gonna look real good when he's done shout out man all right so this your boy va boy oh yeah one more last thing let me give a shout out to uh to uh i think it's 78 chevy boy down in uh, memphis too i love his videos man with penny and then he also got the lord truck as well you know with the ls in it so i want to give a shout out to him too i watch all his videos as well so you know make sure y'all like share comment subscribe to this video um click that notification bell to be a part of 392 gang man until another video man all right y'all stay blessed y'all stay up y'all stay prayed up stay blessed and keep going man all right to the next video peace yeah.